I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know what to say about. I don't. I, I'm at a loss for words. It's sweet. It's spicy. It's savory. It's bomb. It's a bomb turkey breast with a bomb Asian butter. Let's get into it. Let's go. What's poppin' my YouTube fam and welcome back to another video. Today, you guys, on the menu, we are going to roast us another beautiful turkey breast. But this one is gonna be an Asian kind of inspired turkey breast. It's gonna be a Asian garlic butter turkey breast. So what I'm gonna get started on first, you guys, is my sauce that we are going to be basing basting our um, turkey breast with and what I'm starting with is a stick and a half of salted butter put that right in there hope everybody is doing spectacular thank you guys so much for tuning in do not forget to like comment and subscribe if you are not subscribed I'm not too sure what you're waiting for you're gonna be missing out on good things <laughs> so, but I appreciate you all. Hope you guys holiday season has been merry and bright. So you guys, we are just melting down our butter. This is gonna be a delicious sauce. It's gonna be like tangy. It's gonna have some heat in there. It's gonna have some sweetness in there. So I'm, listen, I get so excited about cooking. I, I really do. Food just makes me happy. Cooking makes me happy. So we got a stick and a half of butter going. And what I'm going to do is go ahead and add in some minced garlic. You guys know I can't do anything without minced garlic. I do have fresh garlic in there, but I just don't feel like chopping it and stuff. So minced it is. So we get some minced garlic in there. That was probably two tablespoons. Right there. Right there, right there. Okay, I have my heat like on a medium high. All right. Get that garlic infused in there. Now, you guys, let's start adding in some Asian persuasion. We are going to add in some oyster sauce. Now, a little goes a long way. So, I'm probably going to add, let's see, that's probably a teaspoon of oyster sauce. Okay. We are going to add a teaspoon of hoisin sauce, about like that. This stuff packs a lot of flavor, y'all. So be easy. We're going to add this sweet glaze, which is just, this, this just has a bomb taste, you guys. Okay, so that's also, that's made by Kinko Man. Kikoman. Let's add a teaspoon of that. That's about a teaspoon. We're also going to add a few splashes of soy. Soy sauce. Just a few splashes. Splash, 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 splash. That's probably a tablespoon full. We are going to add in some Cajun seasoning. I'm just going to sprinkle that, eyeball that. You guys know I never do measurements. Love you though. Okay, because we want this to have a little sweet heat. You know what I'm saying? A little Cajun right there. We are also going to add in some brown sugar. That's going to bring that sweet effect. Brown sugar. Sprinkle, sprinkle, dinkle, dinkle. Sprinkle, sprinkle. That was probably a tablespoon or two or three or four or five. Let's give it a nice stir. Smelling great this is going to be a ooh this is gonna be so good on our on our uh, turkey breast all right okay now we have that all incorporated got that nice and incorporated it's starting to get nice and sticky already see that oh okay so what I'm gonna do you guys is turn the fire down to a medium low and I'm going to toss in 
two little slices of lemon because I wanted to, I just want that flavor in there. I think that's gonna make for good flavor. And I'm just gonna let those lemons infuse within my glaze. I'm just gonna let it go slow. So you guys, I'm gonna let this go slow for like two more minutes. Two more minutes, I'm gonna cut the fire off. This is done, set this to the back. And let's move on to our turkey brush, you guys. Stay tuned. All right, my beautiful YouTube fam. We have our nice turkey breast right here. I forgot the before I threw the paper, the um, uh, the wrapper in the garbage, you guys. I forgot how many pounds this is. But I cleaned it off, trimmed off the nasty stuff. Um, this is my third time trying to dry it off. Okay, so... Make sure it's nice and dried off so your seasonings can stick or whatever. Okay, you guys, so we are going to season this breast to perfection. So let me tell y'all, I don't know if y'all know this about me, but I love seasonings. I will buy seasonings from the dollar store. I will buy seasonings from the wholesale spot. I will buy seasonings from Walmart, anywhere. If I see a seasoning I wanna try, I'm gonna try it, add it to my collection. So, look what I found, you guys, at the dollar, the Dollar Tree. No, yeah, the Dollar Tree. Turkey seasoning. Y'all, I already tried it, I already tasted it in the raw form. It's so bomb. Let me tell you what's in it, it's so good. It is, um, of course you got salt. Let's see what else is in here. <clears throat> you got ground turmeric, paprika, garlic, onion, ground thyme, black pepper, and that's it. All the bomb seasonings that you would need, right? All the bomb seasonings you would need for a turkey. So this is like, yo, this stuff here is kinda, it's not salty, but it's definitely mad flavorful. So this is like really all the seasoning you would need. Um, and of course, if you can't find this, you know, just combine the see the spices that I just told you about. But y'all know I'm y'all know I gotta use more seasoning, right? Y'all know I'm just not gonna use this. I can't. I gotta take it up another level, you guys. So I kind of want this to be, like I said, sweet and spicy. So I am gonna go in with some. Ooh, Creole seasoning as well. Creole seasoning right there. Okay, and we are just gonna go kind of like, cause you know that we got that turkey seasoning on there which has all that salt in it and all that other good stuff. So, season that inner cavity. Cause we want this, we want this breast to be flavor on top of flavor on top of flavor and I mean this seasoning is strong too y'all I'm about to sneeze so <coughs> excuse me so this is garlic powder okay there's some good seasoning man I'm telling you it'd be some like good seasoning finds at the Dollar Tree don't sleep for real don't sleep on the Dollar Tree that's some bomb seasoning right there for some turkey for real, for real, for Rizal. So I'm going kind of, I'm going kind of higher with the garlic powder because, of course, it's salt free, and I love garlic powder on my food. Make sure I'm getting every nook and cranny. I'm also gonna go in with some. This is also salt free, of course. Some, oops, all-purpose herb seasoning, you guys. Okay. A little bit of that. This is some good stuff too. Pairs so great. It's gonna pair so great with this turkey. Okay. My pan just sliding all over the place, y'all. I sure hope y'all can see it. So there's our turkey breast, you guys. Nice and seasoned. Nice seasoned turkey breast. So now. My oven is already uh, preheated to 350. We're gonna cook this. I don't know, I'm gonna let you guys know how long I ended up keeping it in at the end. It's probably gonna go for, this is kind of a meaty little breast here. 
so it's probably going to cook for about about two hours about two hours and then towards the end you guys is when I'm going to start basing it with our Asian with our Asian um, what is it our Asian glaze so see I can't I wanted to cook it on this rack you guys but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to cook it on my rack but it's all good you don't really need that so let's take this out there we go I don't think we're gonna be able to roast it on the rack you guys but it's all good it's standing up nice and can y'all see it's standing up nice and good that's all right so let's get this bad boy in the oven yeah it's all good okay so we're gonna get this bad boy in the oven y'all for like I said on 350 for about two hours we go let it go and then we go come back and check and see how it's looking and if it's looking good then we are going to start basting with our glaze stay tuned see y'all this is what you do not do this do not put on that sauce and then walk away from it and forget about it because your sauce will break you see how my sauce broke you see how my um the uh, brown sugar basically burnt basically and see how it broke and separated all the part from the um, butter watch it do not let that simmer for see all that this is not good okay so now we have to redo our sauce do not let this simmer for more than one or two minutes you guys I walked away and started doing 85,000 things I didn't let it simmer for at least about eight minutes tow it up stay tuned man
right my youtube fam this is the turkey breast after it has baked for two and a half hours two and a, between two and a half to three hours and then i took it out baste it one time put it back in there for about five minutes then i baste it a second time put it back in there for another five to seven about five to seven minutes there's that cavity nice and seasoned you guys I'm definitely gonna cut into it for you guys I'm just gonna wait until it cools off so I will be back when it's time to cut into this bad boy all right y'all let me see if I could cut into this breast I'm gonna put my fork right down in there and let's give it a nice oh hope it's not moving everywhere let's give it a nice cut show you guys how juicy there you go juicy Woo! so tender look at you guys delicious done all the way through not dry buttery on the outside sticky on the outside spicy sweet can't go wrong with it can't go wrong with it hope you guys try this recipe out i'm gonna take those i'm looking for a spoon because just a little spoon because i want to take these bottom juices Let's see if i could get some this little spoon I want to take these juices here at the bottom and just kind of ladle it all through in that meat. But my spoon is little. Oh no, my spoon is not doing a job, but oh, y'all get the drift. But you know what, you guys? What you can do also, I have some leftover reserved butter right here and you guys can just do that just like that just like that bomb bomb.com i'm gonna take a little piece this piece right here oh woo, still hot look you guys Ooh. so tender and juicy woo, still a little hot Good. Mm. Mm. Bomb, guys. So good. Thank you guys so much for watching. Appreciate you guys so much. Like I said, I hope you guys try this out. Don't forget to like, comment, and please subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video. Everybody stay safe and stay blessed. Peace.